How's it going, YouTube? Don Judge coming to you from MSP Nambu, Japan. Uh, we're here today with uh, Alan and Rachel of Bridge Moto. And uh, basically, what we're doing is going over the track a little bit with this MRS behind us, not MR2. And we're also going to have some S14 drifting in there. A lot so. of people know Alan. Alan follows Formula Drift and all, a lot of the grassroots uh, events back in the States. And uh, Rachel is here to help him too. She's not, she's not really in the, in the view a little bit, so probably come over a little bit. <laughs> but um, let those guys tell them about you know, their names, where they're from. Uh, a little bit about their company and uh, products that are coming up, things like that that you guys should be watching out for. Like these cool pink ultraviolet uh, gloves right here, pink and black and everything. Uh, for you guys that don't know us, we are Bridge Moto International. Um, we go by Bridge Moto for short. Uh, we're out of Atl north of Atlanta, Georgia. Um, but we are, uh, our goal is to be international and that's why we're here in Japan in Masawa. Our products is our, um, is our goal to uh, expand our products in international. And so here we are at uh, MSP testing some gloves as well as uh, running a grip and gr drift layout. I'm Rachel. Um, Bridge Moto started by Alan and I a couple years ago and we make custom safety gear so everything is FIA and SFI approved and we like to collaborate with other businesses and teams to make really fun colors and things that are unique to our generation. So everything from helmets to the shoes on your feet are made for racing and gonna keep you safe. And they're all basically customizable with colors. The harnesses come in about 10 colors, which is more than pretty much anyone offers, even digital camo. So we're always coming up with new things, like the gloves that's new this year, and. People are loving them. We've had a great response. All of our drivers think that they're super breathable and light, and we're all gonna test them out today ourselves and have some fun out here. Them, uh, testing out the ultraviolet from British Motor Review gloves coming out. How did you feel about the gloves? And the I love them. They're stuff? very grippy and they're very comfortable. I do. I was kind of reluctant at first with the the inside out stitch, but actually it works out because it feels a lot smoother on the inside than I would imagine. I actually enjoy them. And then the uh, the rubberized grip is perfect on the uh, for gripping against like on my car is a it's a suede uh, steering wheel, so it's very nice, very tactile and. Uh, then if we're not having a strap, it's actually a great idea. It's actually easier to put it on and, 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 and put it off as well. I'm definitely looking forward to using your products here in Japan and uh, help you market it and uh, introduce it to the motorsports here. Uh, to do any type of driving event internationally. Uh, also what that does is give you uh, the protection in the case of a fire uh, within the cockpit so you're not burning your hands, trying to get out of the seat belt, things of that nature. Uh, and we offer this glove in six different colors. Uh, you can find them on our website at bridgemodel.com. So Alan's going to be doing a bunch of, um, we're going to be doing a partnership. Myself and Bridge Moto, uh, Alan and Bridge Moto Top Car. And they'll be doing like a little uh, promotion. So um, am I correct in saying like if you got guys that want to do like a, you know, custom embroidery, yep. you guys offer that. So the guys are there, you know, you, you run whatever shop, you want your shop to have your gloves. And it's all about working together. So I mean, in this, in this industry, it's really small once you're inside of it, so you all got to work together to, to you know, get to the next level. So why not, you know, promote Bridge Moto with your brand on it? It's a win-win for everybody. As you guys can see, I got on my uh, my Bridge Moto suit right here, which I love them. They're very durable. This is about washing probably about a lot of times because I mean I get dirty in there, and um, so a lot of lot of lot of different uh, opportunities out there. Just email them and see what they can do for you, and you know everybody doesn't do everything, so you know. We get answered on email. So if you're uh, in Japan or if you've got a relationship with Donald, Donald is our uh, Japanese number one ambassador, so he'll take care of you on any orders that you need uh, going forward, any products that we carry. 
uh, including any custom gifts. So deal with him, and he'll take care of it from there. All right, guys, you guys heard it from that. The Allen with one L and Allen with two L's. <laughs> no, no ease, though. No ease. <laughs> no ease. <laughs> so the uh, driver's briefing is just uh, no rollovers. That's it, no rollovers. All right, man. We just got done with the uh, the small private open track day here at MSP. Uh, dropped an MRS with the um, they had the ATR Sport K tires, which we were testing those out. And also we uh, picked up my buddy, um, my shop assistant, uh, Quan, who couldn't be here today. We picked up his S14, which has one snow tire and one street tire. It's not really good, so I uh, gotta get that fixed. But um. Overall, how'd you like the track and everything? Well, how'd you guys like the track and um, the, the car and all that stuff like that? Yeah, the track and the facility is amazing. Uh, the track, I really love it. Um, I'm a novice when it comes to drifting, so <laughs> I can really see where it's great for learning, you know, car handling, control without adding so much speed. And you can work your way up to speed on the on the downstretch once you, per, you know, um, build your profession in the tighter corners. And as far as grip with the ATRs, it was amazing, uh, especially would have been a wet day. Uh, the tires really gripped up. You were able to lay down on the throttle uh, in the turns and whatnot and still gripped and pulled out just fine. Uh, and the MRS is just was an awesome handling car. I've driven, you know, both first and second gen, so it was nice to drive the third gen and see the difference. Uh, so I thank Donald for that for sure. Yeah, it was fun. The track is like super tight, so it's almost more like an autocross when you're out there and you can get um, some good speed going down the front straight. and. I liked it. I liked the third gen. That's, that's my wife Shinobu, but she don't <laughs> she don't want to talk. So, but she she's driving like a grandma. But she she uh, <laughs> she, she always wanted to drive MRS MR, MRS. We put it out here, let her drive and everything. But the um, yeah, again the the the, the, the ATR Sport Ks are good tires. They also had a, a, a point where you'll be gripping and it'll just like lose everything. And that's kind of when it had to dry wet to the dry to wet situations. Thank you guys for tuning in. Always uh, subscribe and like and share if you would like to. If you don't, cool. Maybe uh, in, the, in the future you'll come around. <laughs> and um, again, this is uh, Donald Jackson uh, signing out from Borderland SP, Nambu Japan. Again with Alan Rachel and Shinobu. See you guys later. Pink Ranger Drift signing out.